zip tie governor bypass and return spring install on this Predator 212 engine for installation on a Yerf dog. This is my zip tie governor removal or governor bypass. Let's take a look. The way that I did it is I actually removed the tank. It was a little bit easier, but I think you could do all these modifications without removing any of the components. And the first thing that I did was, if you look down here, this is the zip tie fix. Right there is the throttle spring. So this is the governor lever. So what it does is it actually backs off the throttle by allowing that spring to flex. And so what I did is, if you can see, the zip tie has to go in front of and in front of both of these two um, linkages. That way it's kind of working so that the spring doesn't, it kind of compresses the spring together. So that's it. And then the other thing that I did is I modified, I just had an old spring lying around and a lot of people were saying when they installed on go-karts, this one's going on that Yerf dog, um, is that return spring. So I just heat up the end of it, kind of stretched it out, put it in that little um, crotch, if you will, there, and then sprung it around, and then it's just bolted to that heat shield bolt. Um, that was my quick, easy, I didn't want to remove any of this linkage. I wanted to use all that, so I didn't want to do I've seen other videos where I guess they've connected it directly. Um, completely bypassing that I wanted to leave everything pretty much stock but I think that will do the trick um, I'll let you know how it goes all right here it is as you can see we've been ripping around for the last couple of days testing out the modifications the zip tie governor bypass and spring install I removed the gas tank when I showed you that way it would make it easier but I think you'd probably do this with uh, if you're skilled with a set of needle nose pliers if you can see under there the zip tie goes on top of the shorter linkage and under the longer one that keeps that spring nice and compressed. And then right here on the other side of that throttle linkage is that spring I pointed out. It goes right from there, right over, and connects down there to the fan shroud bolt. Um, haven't had any problems at all. Been working great. Um, here's my springs off a of sea -Doo, or not a sea -Doo, but a snowmobile. They're working great, much better than stock ones. And then these... Um, RFY springs up front made a huge difference that with that predator motor this thing is a screamer a little ripper around the yard All right, thanks for watching Thanks again for watching. Take care.